Let's take a look at creating as-built joints within the assembly's capability in Fusion 360. The first thing I'm going to do here is zoom out of my assembly so that it fits the screen. If your assembly opens zoomed in to a very high extent, this is a good command to take a look at your entire design on the screen. But I'm going to go ahead and turn off the visibility of the frame as well as the swing arm because I want to use the damper component in this case to demonstrate as-built joints. Go ahead and look at the joints folder for the damper and you'll see that there's two revolute joints in there. We want to come in and create a rigid joint between the shock bottom and the shaft. And so you go ahead and do that and look at that quick animation. You want to create another as-built joint which is a cylindrical joint between the shaft and the shock top. You want to place that joint right at the intersection of the shaft and the shock top and that'll give it a reference from where it extends in and out for the slider component of the cylindrical joint. We want to edit the limits of that slider joint or the cylindrical joint that we just built. We can go ahead and give it a minimum of zero millimeters and a maximum of 30. Look at an animation of how that might work and hit OK. And that is Asbo Joints in Fusion 360.